This video presents our paper, titled Interpretable and Accurate Fine Grain Recognition via Region Grouping. This is presented by Zixuan Huang from University of Wisconsin. How can we design an interpretable deep model for fine grain classification? We propose a deep model that learns to segment object part regions as shown in the middle, and to focus on important part regions for classification as shown on the right. The part segmentation and attribution does provide an interpretation of the decision. Importantly, our model only requires image level label during chaining, without the need of segmentation masks or object boxes. Our model builds on the recent work on developing interpretable deep models using feature attribution and using part discovery. Now, let's dive into the design of our model. The first step is to generate part segmentation. We propose to group the feature maps to discover meaningful object parts in an input image. Specifically, we extract a feature map from a convolutional network. This map defines feature vectors on the 2D plane. Given a prototype of a part, we compare each vector to this prototype and compute their similarity. With a part dictionary learned from the data, we repeat the comparison and assign feature vectors to their nearest the prototypes, generating a part assignment map. We further encode each vector group assigned to a prototype into a region feature vector. Our next step is classification and part attribution. We use region-based attention to select important parts for classification. Our model learns to assign an attention value to each part region, produce a part attention map as shown on the bottom right. The attention values are used to reweight the region features followed by a classifier for fine grain recognition. The key challenge of our model is the learning of part representation without direct supervision. To address this, we propose a novel regularization based on the occurrence of parts. Let's consider some example images from bird species recognition. The head of bird is most likely to occur in all images, while the legs might not be visible in some images. Our key idea is thus, to model the distribution of part occurrence using a U-shaped distribution. This distribution acts like a probabilistic binary switch where we can control the probability of parts on and off by varying the parameter. Here is how the regularization works. Our model detects the occurrence of a part using a max pooling over its part assignment map. The occurrence is further aggregated for all parts within a mini-batch to produce an empirical distribution of part occurrence. This empirical distribution is further aligned to a U-shaped prior distribution. This is done by matching the two distributions using differentiable earth mover distance along each dimension via their CDF. Now, let's move to the results. We first evaluate our model on fine-grained bird species recognition using CUB200. We report standard accuracy of our model. Moreover, we use our part segmentation to regress human annotated bird landmarks for measuring interpretability of our model. For accuracy, we compare our model to other state-of-the-art methods. As shown in the left figure, our baseline ResNet 101 already demonstrates high accuracy, and our model performs on par with the state-of-the-art methods. For interpretability, our method significantly outperforms previous state-of-the-art part segmentation methods by at least 4.4% on the landmark localization task. We further visualize the part assignment and attention maps on CUB200. Our model can find meaningful parts like heads, wings, and valleys for birds, and learns that certain parts such as beaks, legs, and wings are more important for recognition. We also report results on large-scale iNaturalist dataset for species recognition. Our model improved the baseline, ResNet 101, by 5.7% and is only slightly worse than the best result that learns to zoom in the feature map. As there is no landmark annotation, we measure interpretability using point again based on our part attribution. Our model demonstrates an improvement over CAM, GradCAM, and guided GradCAM. More results on Slab A and iNaturalist can be found in our paper. In conclusion, we propose an interpretable and accurate model for fine grain classification via region grouping, part attention, and a novel prior of product occurrence. Our model demonstrates strong results across several datasets. See more details in our project website. Thanks for watching.